Good evening. Now we're running around with the battery on infection. And I'm holding a light, so that's why the lighting just keeps changing. And uh, I'm using the CUDA with the battery. Oh, that's not too bad. I'm using the CUDA with the battery. And uh, the secondary is a rocket launcher. Again, I'm using the theater mode to allow me to do some free camming. Excuse me. And just having a bit of fun. I'm using the CUDA box stock right out of the barrel. I haven't done anything to this uh, class as yet. And I'm doing pretty good in the game. Not epic, but I'm holding my own. And, you know, I'm used to using Semtex instead of the frag grenades, and I'm used to using uh, Thermite instead of the frag grenades. <coughs> I'm not used to using the rocket launcher at all. As you can see, I just <laughs> blew myself up as well as the enemy. I'm wearing my Tales of Poe shirt, as you can see there. And uh, the war machine is ready. Let's turn them into chunks. Although I bounced it off my teammate and killed myself, as you just saw me swoon. Okay. And we're back on the run. With the Cuda. I really need to pick something up. Oh, we're gonna get that guy in the tank. Yep. But it looks like uh, my tactical I have is smoke bombs, which are essentially useless unless you're a sniper, maybe, with uh, infrared sight. I'm not even sure if the infrared sight is in this game, to be honest. So, anyway. Let's run through here and see what's going on. Ooh, looks like a mess over there. It almost looks like a nerf gun, that rocket launcher, doesn't it? Oh, oh, come on, get him, get him. Yeah. I was looking for his gun to switch it for my secondary, but obviously it's not there, which is a little strange. So, let's run, run, run. Come on. Get him. Ooh, they slide away. Save me from getting clipped by this guy. And I got somebody with a sniper rifle trying to light me up. But, oh, I picked up the XR2. I wish I had the Pharaoh. Pharaoh is pretty damn impressive. Yeah, come on, put this guy down. UAV ready. Okay. Oh, put another one down. I'm not sure why. It still says War Machine Kill in the center of the screen. It's a little odd. And now it also says UAV Assist. And uh, War Machine Kill, and I just threw a thing of smoke for some unknown reason. It's just a habit, I guess, to throw the tactical when I see people. Come on, turn them into chunks. It's chunky? Yes, chunky. Hellstorm is ready. Another chunky though, we missed seeing it. Okay, we got a lot of UAV assists and some war machine kills. Oh, we got killed. Oh, and the Talon is ready. We unleash the Talon. See it lagging. Oh, let's unleash the Hellstorm. I didn't realize while I was playing that the camera was on and recording my voice. So it was a little uh, strange. You may hear me go grunt <coughs> while I'm getting shot at. So you may hear that in the background because I didn't realize that the thing was uh, recording as I was playing, which is pretty funny. I guess I'll have to remember to remove the camera plug next time I play so I don't have uh, random sounds and echoes and so forth. Light them up, light them up. Come on, get them. Get them, get them, get them, get them, get them. 
Talon works really well as a protector. It's like having a wingman almost running alongside you. Oh, it's out of it. Ran out of uh, steam and cooked itself and slammed into the ground. And now we're gonna run around that mountain. Like, uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. I think we got somebody behind us. Yeah, we're dead. Damn, knew that was coming. Okay, come on, we need a few more kills. Doing pretty good in the game. Not incredible, but we've got a nice lead. It's a shame that those stained glass windows aren't breakable. It'd be nice to be able to shoot out them. Shoot out. Man, I missed them. I missed them, I missed them. Okay. The frags just take so long to explode if you don't cook them. And if you do cook them and you get into a firefight, sometimes you eat your own grenade. Which is never a pleasant experience. Ooh, chunky! Come on, chunky. And me falling flat on my face. <laughs> I'm now using for a light. Maybe if I lower it. Oh no, it's kind of uh, grainy now. Let's turn it up again. Okay, we're on the second setting. I'm using this little cockamamie. LED light, it's got like 48 LEDs. It's for camping, it's a battery powered camping light called the UFO light. It's got lines of LEDs across the room. It's like four rows on the first setting, and then it's uh, eight rows on the second setting, and then you get all 16 rows, I think, on the uh, top setting. And it's really bright, although it's got a blue tint. I don't know if you could notice that. It's a lot more noticeable when I shoot with a real camera, like my Sony A7. But, uh, this, this is definitely worth buying for 40 bucks, this PlayStation camera. For the simple fact that it lets me do this. And, uh, I don't have to go and dig out my real camera. Have a great night. Bye for now. Onagi wahi!